In today's episode, you will learn how to control the brightness of a 110 or 220 volt AC light bulb using Arduino. Node MCU HP8266 Wi Fi module, MOC3021, BDA16 trike, zero crossing detector, and blink application. With the help of this project, the AC light bulb brightness can be controlled from anywhere around the world. This project is entirely based on my previous tutorial in which I used a potentiometer to control the brightness of the AC light bulb. So I highly recommend you should watch my previous tutorial as I will be using the same connections. In this episode, I will only explain the modifications. Without any further delay, let's get started. The components used in this project can be purchased from Amazon. The components purchase links are given in the description. As you can see all the connections are exactly the same as explained in my previous tutorial. I am using the same dimming circuit based on the MOC3021. I am using the same zero crossing detector circuit. I am using the same 12 volt transformer. The only modification is the addition of the 5 volt regulated power supply based on the LM705 voltage regulator and also added this node MCU ESP8266 Wi-Fi module. As you can see this time I am not using the potentiometer as I will be using my cell phone to control the brightness of the AC light bulb. The Node MCU module TX and RX pins are connected with the Arduino pin number 7 and pin number 8. Make sure you connect the ground pin of the Node MCU module with the ground pin of the Arduino. The 5 volt wire from the regulated power supply is connected with the VN pin of the Node MCU module while the ground of the power supply is connected with the ground of the Node MCU module. First of all, open the Blink application. Click on the new project. Set the project name as Dimmer. Click on the Choose Device and select Node MCU. Make sure you set the connection type to Wi-Fi. Then click on the Create button. An authentication token will be sent on your email ID which will be then used in the programming. Simply copy and paste it in programming. Now click anywhere on the screen and search for the slider and add it. Click on the slider. Set the name as Brightness. Click on the pin and select Virtual Pin V2. Again click on the screen and this time search for the numeric input and add it. Click on the numeric input. Set the title. Click on the pin and select virtual pin V10. 
Set the minimum and maximum values. 10 will be used to turn off the light and 11 will be used to turn on the light. So our application is ready. Now let's discuss the Arduino and Node MCU programming. This project is based on two programs. This program is written for the Arduino while this program is written for the Node MCU ESP8266 Wi-Fi module. Let's first start with the Arduino programming. This program is the combination of my previous two tutorials. Number one, IoT based water level monitoring and number two, AC light bulb brightness control using a potentiometer. So I simply combined these two programs and made a few changes. I changed the pins from 2 and 3 to 7 and 8. So in this project the node MCU module will be connected with pin number 7 and pin number 8. While the rest of the programming is exactly the same. I have already explained these instructions in my previous tutorials. For the best understanding I recommend you should watch my tutorials on the node MCU ESP8266 Wi-Fi module. Now let's discuss the Node MCU programming. As you can see this is the same program which I used in the IoT based water level monitoring system. The only addition is I added the slider and used the virtual pin V2 while rest of the program remains the same. These programs can be downloaded from my blog page. The link is given in the description. I have already uploaded these programs. Let's watch this project in action. Support me on Patreon for more videos. I hope you liked today's episode. Like and share this video with your friends. See you in next episode and thanks for watching.